This, I got this wood rack, I got this off of Craigslist or Facebook or something. It was like 15 bucks. I just can't find any, any more of them. Um, I'm just going to build another one. I want another four feet of wood. I got plenty of room in my garage for this. And I'll run this to about here. Metal rack. It, it works fine. It's nice. It, I got it for um, 15 bucks on, on Facebook. I just can't find another one for a reasonable price. They want $40 for them now. That's crazy. New ones cost 60 that are four foot wide at my local Menards. I just, even that, 60 bucks for a wood rack when I got scrap lumber laying around, I'll build it myself. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna use this material that I had. I got this from an entertainment center and I got some boards. These are from a pallet that they were throwing away at work. So I, I grabbed that and I took it apart and they're good two by fours. 10 inches, so 10 inches, yeah, I've got two 10 inches boards, big box, and then my vertical. right there so if I want like three inches here I get three inches there double them up so you screw the first one in then you screw the second one into the next one yeah that's what I'm doing. that don't look right I gotta push, pull in the whole thing. So how am I gonna do that? How am I gonna pull it in to put stress on it? I'm gonna use a ratchet strap. So. So now, that wood gets loaded onto it. And if you're wondering, because some people have seen previous posts, yes, I did haul all that wood with my Prius V. About an hour and 20 minute drive. It's all oak. It also was wet because it had snowed the night. Two inches of snow was on it. So, yeah. Worked like a champ.
Well, that's the wood pile now. I'll move the trailer back away and stack the rest outside. Bye-bye.